Okay, so I'm gonna show you the side lunge right now. So lunge to the side, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get some of those lateral muscles in here, particularly more of this abductor. So what we'll do here, uh, we're gonna step to the side, you can either alternate or hit all one side and then the other side, but as I push my weight to the side, I step and then drop my hips back, this one leg stays straight and then I fire back to the middle using my outer hip. So we get a big stretch on this adductor we left behind using this abductor, fire back to the middle. And when I do this, I want to make sure as I step, I don't have my knee go forward. You know, just like most of your squats, lunges, my knee's not going forward, heel's not going up. I step and I drop those hips back. My chest does get a little closer to my knee and I drive back. Again, you can do it for your 12 one side or you can alternate for weights. You can use dumbbells, uh, barbells, all that good stuff, a kettlebell in front. Also, it's very good to sometimes use lateral resistance. So here, right, do like this, step into it, and then I use this hip to drive back against either the band or cable. So it gives you a little different feel there. And with the lateral resistance, that actually hits up the abductors a little bit better. It helps emphasize that even a little bit more. 